drones do raise concerns with some people. And joining us now to talk about some of those concerns is WBOC's Lindsay Tuckman. Thanks for coming in on the couches Thank this you. afternoon. <laughs> okay, more and more people, like we said, are using these drones both professionally and uh, personal use as well. But um, so what are some of the things that they're using them for? Well, I'm sure you've seen the photography sure. that comes from drones. I'd say that's the main use, whether it be professional or personal, is to get photos from above uh, that require very little effort. You yeah. don't actually have to go in the air. So mostly to take photographs sometimes to sell real estate. So it goes both ways. Yeah, yeah. And then there are some concerns about the drones. What are they? Um, there's two main ones. The first will be privacy, because of course, you know, taking photos from above, you don't know that that's happening above you. You might be doing something you don't want captured on camera. Uh -huh. So that's the first concern. And then the second is safety. What if it falls on someone's head? Right. It's heavy and it's it's metal. So uh, those are the two biggest concerns. Now, are there laws regarding drones? There aren't a lot of laws, at least a lot of very specific laws. But one main one is uh, that you have to register your drone. So at least it's someone who is uh, written down, they know their name. Uh, secondly, you can't f fly within five miles of an airport without um, permission. Mm -hmm. And then in Delaware State Parks, actually, they're completely forbidden. Uh, and that's just in the parks. That's just in the parks. Now, yes. let's turn to the beaches. I know a lot of people are flying drones over the beaches. Um, what's the response been to this? Well, basically, there is a kind of rule where you have to maintain safety standards. And so it's going to be up to each and every beach town how they maintain those safety standards. Uh, as of now, they're not making their own rules. Uh, but they say if this summer comes and people aren't treating their guests with safety when it comes to flying drones, they're going to take another look at that. Okay, so do the people who are flying the drones, have they responded in some way? Uh, well, basically, they, they say, you know, if you sign up and register your drone, you are responsible for it. Um, and so they're not really wanting any more restrictions to be put in place. If you're willing to go through the steps, as I am, to learn as much as you can learn, um, I would certainly hope that they wouldn't restrict the unmanned aerial aircraft at the beach. All right, I can see where this is not the end of this. This is probably oh, going to go on and on, okay? And of course, you're going to have more on that tonight in your story. Thank you for joining us Thank this you. afternoon on Delmarva <laughs> Life. And you can watch Lindsay's story, Rules of Flight, tonight on WBOC News at 6.